the question given is equations of the straight line inclined at 30 degree to the x axis such that the length of its line segment between the coordinate axis is 10 units is ab hame pehle agar hum hamara coordinate system banaye so this is the coordinate system aur isme dekha hai ki 30 degree to the x axis pe wo inclined hai to iska matlab do line ho sakti hai ek is tarike se where this makes 30 degree and dusri line isko hum de dete hain a b and dusri line is tarike se yahan pe 30 degree hoga and this is a and this is b to ye do lines ho gayi a dash aur b dash le lete hain to ye do lines ho gayi hamare paas ab accordingly hame kya given hai ki ab equal to 10 and in a dash b dash is also equal to 10 that means oa equal to ye kitna ho jayega oa ki value ye ho jayegi 10 ye 30 degree hai to ye bhi 30 degree hoga तो ये हो जाएगा 10 sin 30 डिग्री कंपोनेंट ले ले तो तो OA की वैल्यू हो जाएगी हमारे पास 10 into 1 by 2 that is 5 similarly OB की वैल्यू कितनी हो जाएगी 10 cos 30 डिग्री that means 10 into root 3 by 2 that is 5 root 3 हो गया हमारा OB हमारे पास OA और OB that is intercept तो हमारा लाइन कितना हो जाएगा x by 5 plus y by 5 root 3 equal uh, sorry x by 5 root 3 yoga x by 5 root 3 plus y by 5 equals to 1 that means x plus root 3 y minus 5 root 3 equals to 0 to ek ho gaya amara option uh, c x plus root 3 y minus 5 root 3 equals to 0 uh, दूसरा क्या होगा हमारे पास दूसरा हो जाएगा हमसे यहां पे मिस्टेक हो गया यहां पे y अपॉन माइनस 5 होगा क्योंकि y इंटरसेप्ट नेगेटिव दिया हुआ है तो ये हो जाएगा हमारे पास x minus root 3 y equals to 5 root 3 that means x minus root 3 y minus 5 root 3 equals to 0 अब अगर हम दूसरा पॉइंट देखें तो a b a dash b dash भी 10 है तो O A dash इसकी वैल्यू कितनी होगी 10 cos 30 डिग्री दैट मींस और ये माइनस में होगा क्योंकि नेगेटिव एक्स एक्सिस है तो ये हो जाएगा माइनस 10 into root 3 by 2 दैट इज माइनस 5 root 3 O B dash होगा 10 sin 30 डिग्री दैट इज 10 into 1 by 2 दैट इज O B dash की वैल्यू होगी 5 तो मेरे पास आएगा x upon minus 5 root 3 plus y upon 5 equals to 1 that is x minus root 3 y equals to minus 5 root 3. So, here we have x minus root 3 y plus 5 root 3 equals to 0. So, our answer is x minus root 3 y plus 5 root 3 equals to 0 and x minus root 3 y minus 5 root 3 equals to 0. That are options b and d.